Hey guys, I am going to do a quick video on how to edit the header and the footer on Homey um, real estate booking website. So check out the screen right here. I'm about to show you. Okay, here we go. Here's the screen here. I am going to show you how to edit this information here, which is the header and also the footer. Uh, this is a special request. So I'm going to do a quick video right here to show you. So here is the logo. So right here in the back end is your logo, uh, which shows up right here. And this is the header. Um, you change this logo out, these logos, which you got the mobile ones and it shows you right here how to edit everything. So once you change one, it will show up right there. Okay, so let's go to the navigation for the header, which is here. And uh, let me do a quick refresh. So there's different options of the header. So right now is the one. I'm going to show you what two looks like. Let's go here, let's save it and update see here we go so this is two I'll show you what two looks like right here different layouts here's here's the user information once you log in it shows you there let's go to another header header three right here it shows you see it shows in the middle and then your your menu is here, your logo is here. Um, here's the login information right here. Let's go to four. And this is four right here with the side menu right here, option. Um, your login is right here. Um, and then let's go, so you can change it to box version. Let me show you, let, let you see what this looks like. Let's refresh. It's gonna bring it in. So so the, the long version, the full width is like this, and then the box bring it in, as you see here. Um, so um, here's your, your um, navigation. So you can do left, right, or center, usually set up on um, the left side right here. So for your menu, if you change it, you say you want to put it on the right, and then it's going to show up on that side. Um, actually, this is the left. Let's go. So with the right alignment header, let's see if it shows up. As you see right here, so it shows up on the right. And then if you want to switch it over, it will show up right here on the left. Um, let's go. So right here is for your button. You can choose um, the option here, and you can put whatever you want right here. Your button will show up right here on the header um when you are not logged in so since i'm logged in you're not going to see it um and it's going to show it there um so here's the header information here let's go down to the footer here is the footer right here that showed the different layouts right here which connects um it tells you uh how you want to have a layout different box right here the shapes and that's with the wedges. It's going to go right here. Here, uh, you want to do the social media on the footer. Right here, you put your link, social media links right here. Um, right now, we're going to change this, which it shows up uh, right here on the footer, right there. Let's change it. And now the content I put here will show up right here on the footer. So as you see here, that changed. I'm gonna show you how to edit this information right here 
which is four sections, one, two, three, four, because that's what we select here, one, two, three, four. So let's go here. Let's go to your widgets. And right here, here we go, your footer. Right here, one, two, three, four. So these are your footer widgets here. And this is where you edit your page. So everything that's shown here is right here, as you see. So this is all the information right here. This is your um, image logo, which you copy the link. And then that shows right here. The contacts, read more, all that is right here. It's all three, four, three options right here, the three blocks. And let's say if you want to change something, you can remove it and just take something here and just slide it over. So let's say I want to put categories right here. Done. And then uh, you got this, you have to um, put it there. And then let's see if it's saved automatic. See, there we go right here. Do you see the categories show that right here? So you can change it right here as the each blocks are set up right here. So each one, you just take something from right here and move it in over here to add it. So if you want to remove everything that shows nothing, you would just delete everything. You delete it right here. And then everything will be moved. So now everything that shows up right here it will be no longer there because I removed it. So let's refresh the page. Show it back down as you see. Nothing is there because I removed it. So if you want to change the color uh, on the footer, let's go down to the style. Let's go down to the footer right here, and then here's the color. So you want to change it to white. And then let's say the text, you want the text to be black or gray, or whatever you want it. And then you make sure you save it. Now you go back here. And then here, as you see, the footer is white. It blends in with the site. And so that's, that's kind of it. So you can do the same thing with the color and the header. You can color the header as well. So right now the header is what color is um, set like this, but if I want to change the color of the header, I will have to change, I will have to go to the header navigation, change it to something else, go here, show here. Now the header is white. So now we'll go to the color, to style, header, color, change the header background and say I want it black. Now my header size will be black. See right here, it's black. So up here is a different option. So that's black. So you want to go to the different options. So the header is black. And then here, there's the button option here. And then here, you want to change the top based on which header you have. Since I'm using two or three header, I have to change it here as well. Now the header will be black, see? Because it's part of the header color. So you gotta know which option are you choosing. And here is the line, the solid line that shows up. Um, let's say I want to make that black as well, or so it won't show this line in between. So this line right here is going to disappear once I refresh it. See, as you see, the line is gone. So that's it right there, you guys. Um, change the footer color. I went through how to change up the different uh, menus, things like that. And if you want to do change the menu, let me show you that real quick before I end out the video. That is on the menu section, which is here. You go here to the menu, and then that's right here. As we can change, you find the main header is this one, and this is the header that shows here and then you will change it from here, or you can create a new uh, menu here that shows up. All right, you guys, um, that's it. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any questions, uh, definitely uh, drop a comment, um, like the video, until next time.